<laughs> yes. Yes. This is one of them ones. Roll my intro. YouTube, what's happening to y'all? Ken Folk, it's your friendly neighborhood sneaker man, Goat Weezy. Weezy, a baby. Please say the baby. I'm back on the scene once again, man. Back with another video for y'all. And if you're watching this, you already know what time it is, man. Release day Saturday. Man, we got them white cement three things. Bruh. Now, I initially did a video, but I didn't post a video because I had early access. I hit did hit the early access pair, but we're going to talk about it. But anyway, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hold smash that subscribe button for your boy and ring that notification bell so you don't miss out on any video that I put out. Y'all know we get busy over here and I'm back. But uh, let's go ahead and get started. And truth be told, I might just give y'all some footage from the early review pair that I did, but let's go ahead and get started, man. Hi, <laughs> what's up, man? What's up? What's up? What's up? No, I'm vlogging. No, I'm vlogging. <laughs> what's up? What's up? Oh, no, I'm working today. No, I'm working today, man. Working or you going to sign it? Oh yeah, that's what we put in the group chat, right? I don't. I'm not even. Oh yeah, in the you ain't chat. in the group, but y'all be playing cards, though, right? Listen, bro. I got blessings. Oh yeah, you you a, you a god, no? We already know. For real, what's up? What's up? Everybody with the black cement song? Oh, yeah, you ain't in the group chat either. What's up, bro? What's going on? Yeah, she ain't been long enough. That's what I need right there. I don't know how I slept on those. What's up, bro? Hey, see? I had a lot to choose from, man. Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Oh, we look like we got a lot back here. What's going on? Too much. A lot. Yeah. Oh, snap. Why, why, why would y'all put this trash? Who is this? Oh, yeah, we got to have a discussion. Nah. I don't want to see this, man. So this is what we doing. This is what we doing. Now, y'all saw the intro, y'all see the title. This is my early pick for Sneaker of the Year. We've, we've gotten pretty much a gist of what we're going to get, especially far as like Air Jordans. I ain't too keen, I ain't too happy to see what we're getting for this year. To me, it's another dead year, but to a lot of the new people that's starting to get into sneakers, they probably going to get everything that come out. But your boy been pushing it real slow. But this sneaker right here is definitely... A top three sneaker of the year. So without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this thing because I ain't trying to keep y'all long. Ooh-wee. All right, so I feel like I can probably rip this off. Now, this pair actually came from the exclusive access. Now, I'm going to put the information right here. Y'all know Nike be capping sometimes. Nike, Nike can get. They be lying real bad sometimes. But they kind of told the truth on this one. I did not have... Early access, well, I did have early access. I didn't hit on the shock drop, and I didn't hit on the free throw line threes that came out back in 2017, I think it was. I know I was living in Fayetteville. But, uh, yeah, so they said if you, ain't, if you ain't hit the early shock drop, if you didn't get the free throw line threes in 2017, then you had access to these. And your boy had access, man. So shout out to my, my shoe tang fellas. For putting me on game. Uh, I think Cadillac Jackson put it in the group. I don't even be having my phone no more like that, man. That's crazy. But I like it like that, man. You know, this ain't nothing but the Matrix. Damn, I, that's a gray hair. Oh, shoot. That's a, well, I'm, I'm getting old out here. But y'all see my beard shining there. Thank you feel me, your boy. Your boy looking good now. And I'm losing weight, too. Ooh. But nah, man. This one. This is a double up for me. And I'm going to tell y'all, do not sleep on this sneaker. Because if y'all sleep, bro, somebody like me, I'm trying to get three pairs, so don't sleep. But let me go ahead and I ain't even going to fast forward. I'm just going to rip the box because Nike shipped my stuff like this. But it was, you know, it came pretty quick. Uh, 
Early access was like March 2nd, and today is Sunday. By the time y'all see this, it'll be Monday or Tuesday. So, damn, I can't even get the bottle. Shout out to Nike Sneakers App. Sneakers App been showing me some love lately, man. You feel me? <laughs> get that out of there. Ah. Ooh, wee. Look at that box, man. Look at that box. I ain't trying to be funny, but uh, my adults get it. All the adults got that, but anyway, check out the box, this vintage box, white cement three reimagined. I have never had any iteration of the white cement threes. I do have the black cement threes up there somewhere, and I just wore them for the first time like a couple weeks ago, and whew, them things fire, man. Threes might be my favorite silhouette. Sixes, threes. Mm, I got an ass of ones, but I don't, I don't too much care about ones no more because everybody like ones now. But I'm going to read this thing out to y'all, man. It says Air Jordan 3 Retro. The colorway is Summit White, Fire Red, Black, size 12. Anything y'all know, I get in the size 12. I got it for me, bitch. Try 12. Let y'all see that. Woo. Fresh from Sneakers Out. Shout out to Sneakers Out once again. All right, and the box definitely is giving that vintage worn look. Now, I I particularly don't care about the box like that, even though, like, the aesthetics on it is cool, but I ain't really worried about that. All right, so y'all see we got our little card, our little material card, and Jordan Brand, bring us the uh, retro cards back, man. You know, I'm in my 30s now. I remember getting those retro cards as a teenager. So bring those, bring those retro cards back out, man. Come on. But I guess this like the little information sheet, the how to, you know, the materials, how the tools was made, but that's either here nor there. Y'all came to see these got dog on sneakers. So y'all see our white cement paper. Pull that back like it's PT Cruiser. Ooh. <laughs> yes, sir, ski. Yes, sir, ski. Oh boy, I don't think the camera doing no judge. Do I need to turn the light up? God dang it, man. Oh, this is a beautiful sneaker. This is a beautiful sneaker, man. God dog it. Oh my Lord. Oh man. Oh man. Man, we ain't got nothing but one thing to do. And let's talk about these sneakers, man. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, the Air Jordan 3 White Cement. Probably one of the greatest sneakers of all time, you feel me? I, I could be biased because I'm a Jordan 3 guy. I like Jordan 3s, three, and 3's three, definitely one of my favorite silhouettes. But this one right here, oh my God, crazy. And I don't know if I got too much light shining or what, or this might might be just, just enough light. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Oh my God, yes, yes, yes. But let's go ahead and go into details right quick. And y'all know I like to start from the bottom up, man. God, no, my hair nappy. I'm trying to grow my, my locks back. I'm trying to puff it up right quick. But anyway, start from bottom on up. All right, so as you can see, we have our gray and white outsole. That outsole and that gray, red, and that white. And this white, I don't know, the white on the bottom look kind of sale, but we ain't even gonna see the bottom anyway, man. All right, now heading up into the midsole. Now the midsole is where you get that cream or that cell, that vintage look, you know. These threes don't have the same story as the Lost and Found, it's just a reimagined. Now the Lost and Found, they came with the receipt. It was just supposed to be a crazy story about how a pair of shoes can get stuck in the back of a store. And like I said, y'all said in the last video, like I said in the last video, y'all know I work at Foot Locker, this, that, and the third and shoes definitely do get lost in the back of the store sometimes so but i like the story behind that the ones have but the threes necessarily don't have a true story they're just called the reimagined but i'm assuming it is that same type of feel you feel me all right now heading up we do have our black on that thing where our air bubble is Whew. all right now heading up to the up uh, up along the midsole we do have our white we got that smooth leather on the midsole that smooth leather right there which goes all the way around to the toe cap now the toe cap does have that elephant print and the elephant print definitely does look a little aged as well 
um probably doesn't do it any justice on video but you will see it in hand that it does have that aged look all right heading up into the upper we have our tumbler leather white upper hey man this is a1 angus a1 angus beef i'm talking about hardest carl juniors wherever you live where i live they call it hardest but i know in like when you start to go upstate or in the midwest they got carl juniors but we got the hardest down here in the south you feel me and hard and high both for real all right now stand along with the upper we do have our red lace holes up here got that red lace hole and then they do come factory lace with white laces head up onto the tongue our tongue does have that jump man that red jump man and then on the inside of the tongue it is red mm, i like that and you can see on the insole i probably won't show y'all the insole but you see on the insole the insole is all red with nike air and black and our size sticker all right now heading on to the back now the back heel right here definitely has that aged look i love it i love it i love it i love it got that aged look and then it has nike air and black and once again we have our elephant print elephant print definitely does have that aged look so hey man i gotta give these a 10 out of 10 dog I, I really do gotta give these a 10 out of 10 this is without a shot of a doubt the sneaker of the year in my opinion as of right now i'm just gonna say as of right now because we don't know what other silhouette or what other brands have going on i know i'm real big on joe fresh goods and dog and joe fresh goods been doing his thing these past couple years and people be sleep but i'm glad they're sleeping on new balance man now speaking of sleep do not sleep on this sneaker all right especially if you're a casual if you're a casual and you're trying to get a pair of these you need to do everything you need to be on the hibbers app you need to be on champs foot locker um snipes whatever to try to get these they're saying the numbers are only five hundred thousand pairs which i really don't believe any of those numbers to keep it real which i i never believe those things but it's people like me that's trying to get two or three pairs like this is my first pair right here and I'm definitely going to get a pair from the store I work at. And I might try to get another pair. Who knows? But like I said, two or three for sure. I got to double up on these. Like, it's it's a must. But I'm going to give y'all some B-roll. We're going to hop back. And we're going to end this joint, man. Once again, we have the Air Jordan 3 White Cement Reimagined. Y'all let me know in the comment section below whether or not this is a pickup for you. I'm telling y'all once again, do not sleep on this sneaker because resellers are hungry. You already know. And I think these are gonna shoot up. They might not be on the same level as the Lost and Found, but I'm predicting these to shoot up. And y'all know I really don't do resale predictions. I can't stand it. Like, I ain't even gonna, I ain't gonna sit back and hold y'all, man. I can't stand it. But anyway, like I said, y'all let me know in the comment section below how y'all feel about these, man. But once again, this has been your friendly neighborhood sneaker man, Goat Weezy Weezy F, baby. Appreciate y'all for coming through, and y'all know how I get out of here, baby. Love, peace. All this beef, throw some chicken grease on that thing. Your boy gone.